Hi, and welcome to another video, and today I will be making pancake cereal. I've seen pancake cereal literally everywhere on TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, Snapchat. Okay, now I'm just naming up. But it is literally everywhere, and I thought why not try to make it like the other half of the world is doing right now. And for those of you who don't know what pancake cereal is, you basically just make mini pancakes and it'll look something like this. And then you pour maple syrup as kind of a milk, but not as much as you'd usually put milk in. Because that would be a lot of maple syrup. Also, if you haven't done it already, please subscribe. It's right down there. And that would mean so much to me. And let's get on to it. I have the Aunt Jemima box mix. The box is a little messed up, but we're going to make it work. And I'm just going to follow the instructions. Okay, so one cup of mix. I got the one cup. There we go, I'd say that's about a cup. Three quarter cup of water. Now I need a whisk. Okay, why don't I have anything? Okay, it's nice and runny. I never really make pancakes well, so let's just hope this works out. I'm also kind of concerned about flipping it, you know, because like it's hard to flip a lot at the same time. It's always such a letdown. Pancake mix never tastes good. I've seen videos where people pipe it out in a piping bag. Literally every time I put something in a piping bag, it just fails. So I'm going to use a small spoon and just hope for the best. Where do we keep our pan? Got it. Okay, so I'm going to oil up the pan. There we go. I'm just going to take a spoon and just drop it. This is really good. Also, I think this is like pancakes or like a breakfast thing. It's 4 p.m. in the afternoon. Am I gonna let that stop me? No. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I have six in the pan. Oh, no, the spoon. Oh my God, they're ready. Oh my God, okay, wait. Ah, this is a tad stressful. They bake a lot quicker than I thought they would. Okay, now I'm just flipping them randomly. I don't know which ones are ready and which ones aren't. First six. Are done. They should make this like an actual cereal because I'd buy that. Like pancake bites, pancakes to go. I think I'm onto something. <laughs> now we scoop them again. Is it weird they taste better than normal pancakes? Probably a little. They also are done cooking like after 30 seconds somehow. So it's way faster than I thought it'd be. Ah. Okay, I've noticed a few things. Number one, I made way too much batter, but I'm still gonna use it up. Am I gonna eat more pancakes? Definitely. And number two, I like making them way smaller. In the beginning, I made them really big, and now I realize that I just like them tinier, more cereal size, bite size. Third thing I've noticed, I can't stop eating them. Like, I've probably had 10. Oh my god, they're not flipping. God, okay. I'm just gonna go like this. So, this is gonna be my last batch, and I'm gonna just save the dough because this is actually really time consuming. Actually, it's not. It's like 20 minutes. I'm just impatient, so. I'm not impatient. I'm hungry. Which actually, I guess, makes me impatient. Okay, I finished. Finally. So right now I have my plate of mini pancakes. I got a bowl. Woo! I'm just gonna pour these in. Because of this video, I have legit real maple syrup. And I usually, my family usually buys the fake stuff because it's cheaper, but I'm going all out for this. I saw a video where you put milk in it. I think that's gonna be nasty because I think they'll just get soggy like cereal. So I'm just gonna use syrup. I switched the camera angle. But now I'm gonna pour the syrup on, which is exciting. <gasps> okay, now the taste test. Okay, it's pretty good. Of course it tastes like pancakes, but it's good because I like to have pancakes like that are drowning in maple syrup, so this is great. It did take a bit longer and I have to admit, I might have gotten a little frustrated making it. It's really good. Okay. 
I'm trying to film an outro. I can't stop eating. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. And go like this video. Go comment whatever your soul is feeling. I don't know why I just said that. And please subscribe. That means so much to me. And I'm going to finish eating this and enjoy some bloopers. <gasps> now, wait. And... Do you ever get sad when you finish something? Like you're